This is, was a prophecy by our ancestry. You'll see this black death. They couldn't describe it. It'll come. You'll see people talking in these boxes. You'll see way out there. Figure that out. It's here. Everything that they prophesied is here. On March 24th, 1989, the unthinkable happened. The oil tanker Exxon Valdez, loaded with over a million barrels of North Slope crude oil, grounded on Bly Reef in Prince William Sound, Alaska. The impact to the people and wildlife who live here was devastating. It's hard to describe except try and picture a place in, that you care about, that you put all your heart and soul into and think a lot about and then think of it with several feet of oil dumped on top of it, black crud, and doing everything you can to clean it up and knowing it's pretty futile. The 11 million gallons of crude oil that rushed out of the torn hull of the 987-foot tanker created an 11,000 square mile oil slick. Efforts to contain what quickly became the largest and most destructive oil spill in U.S. history failed miserably due to a lack of equipment and organization. Hopelessness swept across the sound as oil washed up on over 1,000 miles of shoreline in one of America's last unspoiled wilderness areas. The destruction of animal life was unprecedented. An estimated 250,000 seabirds, 2,800 sea otters, 300 harbor seals, and up to 22 killer whales were lost in the wake of the Exxon Valdez spill. Six months after the spill, Exxon called off the massive beach cleanup effort. Crews returned the next three summers, but only about 15% of the spilled oil was ever recovered. What did not end up on the beaches either evaporated, sank, or drifted into the Gulf of Alaska. Oiling beaches along the Kenai Peninsula, the Alaska Peninsula, and the islands of Kodiak hundreds of miles from Bly Reef. The battle that was lost in Prince William Sound resumed in the courts. In 1991, Exxon was ordered to pay state and federal governments $250 million in criminal penalties and a $900 million civil settlement to be used for continuing restoration efforts, including an ambitious scientific program to monitor the recovery of the spill region. <laughs> 